that's it. I'm done. I'm ready to go on a date. Hi, my name is Rachel Wan and today I will be showing you how I would do date night makeup. I first start with a primer. I use the Urban Decay Rebound Spray. It, I mean, I first tried it because it says that it comes with collagen and you know, I'm a sucker for anything with collagen. So now that I, my face is primed, I usually also put on um, this Maybelline Baby Skin Pore Eraser. You can get it at any Watson store, right? And it's so good because it really minimizes the pores on my face and then like my foundation goes on more smoothly after that. So then next, I keep this little spray bottle so I can just spray my beauty blender to make it wet. I use Tarte, it's like super high coverage, but I like it because then you don't have to use so much. Okay, now I, put, I think I put too much water. <laughs> Next is to conceal, get this orange uh, colour corrected. So I use this to kind of colour correct my under eyes. And then I use the Tarte Shape Tape. I don't even have to use much. And I, I like to use my finger rather than my beauty blender. Okay, I think I'm done. So I'm going to set my makeup with um, this setting powder from Tarte. Okay, then I'll do my eyes. So uh, I like to go between like this light brown first over my lid and then like with the same brush I'll go with a darker one and I'll go like from the center so that's my version of a smoky eye then next I'll just I'll go with eyeliner and also from Tarte I spent years going out with uneven eyeliner until like I figured out what side needs more because you know everyone's face is not symmetrical right so you have you have to figure out which side needs like more of a curve which side is uh, needs to be thicker so that when you open your eyes, it looks even. Now I'm done with my eyeliner, but I'm a little bit extra. I can't just stop there. I like to smudge out my eyeliner with eyeshadow. So I go back with the same like dark brown over here. Just smudge it out along the line. So as you know, it makes it a little bit more smoky and not so like straight. I go in with a gel eyeliner and uh, I line my bottom line with that. And then I'll take that angled brush again and then I'll smudge it out. Yeah, so it's not so like harsh. Okay. Next, eyebrows. What I like about this um, eyebrow pencil from Brow House is that because the colour is just so natural, just brush it out. And ta-da! My brows are done! Uh, what do I do next? Oh, contour. I like to use this. Mixed with a little bit of this, get the best of both worlds. Huh? I find it's best right under the cheekbone. Bring it down here. I'll always put my contour first and then I'll cover my scar. I have a scar here from um, when I was young, I had chicken pox. But this one is not so bad because like, it's not in an obvious place. And then now, blusher. The blusher that I use is um, this L'Oreal one. It's called Sunset Glow. What I like about it is because like it comes with um, shimmer as well so then there's like I, I mean I would use it for date night because you know the highlighter is just there already you look a little bit shiny with this candlelight or reflect off your blusher you know okay now I'm gonna do my nose contour I use this brush that I stole out of um, uh, uh, eyeshadow palette so the same colors I use on my cheek contour. I am aware that I don't look super, super Chinese and I think my, my skin is also a little bit darker than most. No matter how you look, right, if you accept it, if you accept the way you look, you'll be happy, you know? So my um, second final step, I will be doing my lipstick and because it's date night, I'll go with red. I tend to stick to more uh, cool tone reds. You know why? Because cool tone colours make your teeth look whiter. Okay? I used to always try and follow makeup trends. But over the years, right, I've learned that it's best to just use makeup that is good for you. And uh, I'll set my makeup with the best setting spray I feel ever. Alright, so I'm done with my full date night makeup. Everyone here is telling me that like I actually took quite fast with my makeup, but I'm like, I'm I feel like I take forever in the toilet. My mom is always complaining. So let me know in the comments if you were to do every single step that I've done, how long would you take? Well, thank you for watching and bye!